Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Trogdor and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, at long last, I have the week four of the PTL. If you watched my team builder, you're probably thinking to yourself, huh? Why did this, well, if anyone's really keeping track of when I post things, then good for you. And you're like, huh? Who shade? Why are you talking about uh okay so basically like i made the team builder we are gonna play later that day and then shade dropped i waited a while for the replacement coach to get here by all rights i should have been like an easy forfeit because the entire league like we had six drops within the span of a day which was ridiculous Having 48 people participate in one league, scheduling all those battles, making sure that people aren't dicks, is just awful. And as technically one of the admins of the league, I was not really okay with the way things went down. And things happened the way that they happen. I guess this is turning into kind of a rant of the week, I guess, huh? <laughs> And yeah, the, this battle is like also very rant worthy. So that's a bit, that's a little bit more appropriate. Okay. So by all rights, week four should have just been like a forfeit. Not just for me, but for many others. Things just like the amount of time it's taking us to get back on our feet is not really acceptable and just because like a few people were talking smack and didn't get along and we still got some people who are just not i don't know i'm not allowed to have an opinion i'm just here to like run things and automate the sheets and make bad youtube videos so uh yeah let let's get into the the battle i guess so my opponent is not shade my opponent is, in fact, uh, Lunar, who picked up uh, shortly after. So thanks for coming in and picking up uh, a team and, and yeah, battling right away. So the problem is I built a team thinking that I was playing Shade. And a lot of the time, I play the player, not the opponent. So there are a few things that I was like kind of expecting would happen that definitely are not going to. This is not the team I expected to see at all. I honestly thought that like like Mantine I didn't think made any sense versus my team. Sneasel kind of cuz I do have Landorus and my team is somewhat ice weak, but I have like priority in like Hitmonchan. I have very good switch into Sneasel. And I also have Sneasel's big brother, Weavile. Which it's like, I know how to play Weavile and I know work works well. And Sneasel is just kind of like a bad version of that. So I only expected like of these six, I was only expecting like Latias, like Dodoy, Infernape, Dodoy, and Ferrothorn. There's no Diggersby, there's no... Well, I was kind of like torn between like either Mantine or Bruxish. So there's none of that. that. I forget, what else did he have on his team? Yeah, Galvantula. That could have been good, especially for like speed control. And the way I play, Hazards kind of give me a headache. And I don't have a lot of reliable removal on my team. So I was relieved to not see Galvantula. I was relieved to not see Diggersby. However... Seeing Sylveon, I'm thinking to myself, what was I thinking? Why don't I have Steelix? Why did I not bring Landorus instead of Tyrantrum? Okay, so last minute I switched Tyrantrum from Dragon Dance to Choice Scarf. Because Scarf Tyrantrum is actually a really fantastic speed tier. Uh, Adamant max speed outspeeds uh, his fastest thing. And also, I didn't have a safe chance to set up. Rock Polish Landorus, or Calm Mind Landorus, could have been like, 
could have blown through this. Call mine Yachi Berry. Like, Sylveon, you're gone. Infernape, you're gone. Ferrothorn, you're gone. Sneasel, I'm going to let you hit me with Ice Shard. But Yachi Berry was the greatest item of all time. And you're gone. And then that's like Mantine. Like, Rotom yeets all over that. Mega Ladia is like Azu Maryland Weavile yeet all over that. So it's like. And then. For a bulky pivot, I thought Type Null would be great. Why didn't I bring Steelix? Because Steelix at least can hit back. Sure, the Ferrothorn walls me. But Hidden Power Fire on Cresselia and Type Null do like nothing to it. I know, I'm going to start playing and uh, switch sides because. Yeah, I, I, I like me being on... Where am I pointing to? I like me being on... Uh, right there, not up there. So, I'm looking at this team and thinking... Oh, no. Oh, no. There's, like... Mega Latias is just a stall fest. Ferrothorn's a stall fest. Mantine without Rotom I can't break. Sylveon... Nothing can break that. That is a massive oversight in my prep. So let's let's get into it. And um, yeah, so I should have gone for Volt Switch because he's obviously going to go for U-turn. But I switch into Cresselia like an intellectual, and he's going to get momentum right away. That damage on Infernape is not going to matter at all. And yeah, Hidden Power Fire on Ferrothorn is a three hit KO, no four hit KO at best, and he's just going to toxic stall me. So I'm going to yeet all over him. I can yeet on anything with the Volt Switch, but I'm thinking to myself, what can I do to this Sylveon? I can Toxic it, but it probably has Heal Bell, and it's going to just switch into Mantine. Sure, I can get the slow momentum as he goes for the Scald. Burns me, but like, who's counting? And I'm going to go back into Rotom, because it's like, I can Volt Switch on literally everything. I can Thunderbolt on everything. So I Volt Switch right here, gonna go into Tyrantrum because I can, uh, or no, uh, Weavile just because it's like, get out of here. I should have gone for the knockoff because I would have gotten rid of Sylveon's leftovers and it would have been in uh, range for Tyrantrum's head smash, force it to wish. And now he's just gonna keep getting all that back and I'm just thinking like, oh no. Also I should have had Poison Jab on my Weavile. So I want to get a status of some kind, but of course it has the heal bell. Toxic would have been better. Would have forced him to do things. Thunderbolt's close to a 3-hit KO if I can get rid of leftovers. But... And AV Ozumaro, it's like, I can't really stay in versus this. Even though I can 2-hit KO with play rough. Not even, because that's max physically defensive. And I'm not choice banned. So he's doing more damage to me. and uh, So close, so close. Ugh. So close. So yeah, the only thing I can really do for Sylveon is Rotom. I have more Thunderbolts than he has Wishes. And Hyper Voice is doing little enough that I can get Leftovers recovery back to by the time that I hit enough Thunderbolts that it dies. But this is just... This is just one of those games where I'm thinking like... What was I thinking? Oh yeah, para Parahax, but you know, that's whatever. Because he gets the Wish back and is going to go for the Heal Bell. And two Thunderbolts can't kill him from this range. Should have gone for the knockoff with Weavile. Anything getting knocked off would have been amazing. Latias sure as heck wasn't staying in. So, yeah, I, I'm playing Stall. Ver well, I'm playing against Stall, which, in my opinion, like, uh, I, I don't like playing Stall. I know it's like how to win. I, I should have. Why, why did I stay in versus this Latias? He's going to, like, now I die to when he gets up rocks. I thought like, oh, momentum will be great. I can go into T-Rex mode and scare him out with an Outrage, go for the Head Smash, but of course Ferrothorn comes in, and I can't do it KO with Head Smash. I should have, could have gone for the Fire Fang too, but I thought Sylveon was the obvious choice because of my Outrage, but yeah, and it's just not happening because yeah, he's got up rocks, Rotom's going to die, and that was like the only thing I had that I was actually like doing decent damage to his team so it was over before it even started and he can just switch between literally ferrothorn and sylveon and i can't do anything back 
Like, Ozumero can't break them. Tyrantrum can't break them. Weavile can't break them. Like, Cresselia is just a sitting duck. Rotom's gonna die. So, just... <clears throat> and everything's just gonna go down to, to Knock Off, to Toxic, to Leech Seed Damage, to Rocks. It's not happening in my favor. Uh, yeah, I, I should have had Poison Jab instead of Low Kick. Like, at, at least I could have done some damage to this the Sylveon. Like, I finally get rid of the Leftovers, but... Yeah, he's going to get rid of his Toxic. And... and uh, yeah. Yeah, this, this, is, uh, this is what I get. And... I don't like playing Stall in League. Because, in my opinion, the fun part about League format is the creative prep. Because... It's like, it's not standard format, so you can create, like, really tailored sets that specifically beat your opponent's team, and it's, like, in my opinion, just a lot more creative, and a lot more room for, like, you know, seeing what you're capable of as a team builder, what you're capable of as a battler, and, oh yeah, the, the last few turns of this battle is just insult to injury. Gonna get crit, gonna get, like... It's going to be a miss. Like, it's just not going to be fun for me these last few turns. So, yeah, sack road. I'm like, what were you doing, man? You go into Sylveon. It's like, oh, what what, what the heck can I even do to you? Like, miss versus head smash. Yeah, I add insult to injury. I go down. So, yeah. And, like... Getting getting six would by a stall team like yeah that that's that's great that that's really great so so yeah that was that hopefully I can actually play some more not stall teams for the rest of this season but I I, I play this game so that I can have fun team building so that I can make enjoyable YouTube content instead of just like a 12 minute video of me face palming. So yeah, if you enjoyed this battle, let me know. <laughs> let me know which part because I yeah I don't know. Uh, like the video if you if you liked it for some reason. Comment down below if you got anything to say. Uh, subscribe if you're new because I'm gonna be doing other. PTL battles, they're, you know, other cool PTL battles. And yeah, otherwise, I'll see everyone in the next, next video. Take care now. Bye-bye.